While several countries around the world are witnessing major heat waves, such as the case of Italy in Europe where drought is hitting farmers, and Japan in Asia where sweltering heat forces people to switch off light to save power, in Australia properties and roads are inundated by flood water after heavy rain hit Sydney. Thousands of people have been ordered to evacuate following warnings of flash floods and landslides amid heavy torrential rain. So this combination of uh, heavy rainfall uh, and the overflows uh, out of Warragamba Dam uh, is causing the river to rise quickly uh, and we are likely to see significant flooding. The Bureau is uh, now warning us uh, that later tonight the, the Hawkesbury and Nepean rivers will rise higher than what we experienced uh, in March 2021, March 2022 and April of 2022. Shortly, the SES will be issuing dozens of evacuation orders and warnings. Some areas in Australia's biggest city have already reported floods of 1.5 metres. Rainfall is expected to intensify over the coming two days. We want the community to be aware of their risk. Um, as stated by the Bureau, we're anticipating that these levels will rise above the last 18 months of flood levels. Heavy rain and overflowing dams and rivers all combined threatened the lives of animals as well, which by using boats were brought to safety on the dry land. It's a different task to moving humans. Uh, livestock tend to have their, their times where they want to move around, jump around, so we need to secure them a lot better to be able to transport them. Australia is particularly hard hit by climate change, with regular droughts, devastating forest fires and repeated and increasingly intense flooding.